you are moving from a company that helps you finances to a company that helps you get things done now when you search for something like muscle flexion you can view a 3d model built by visible body right from the search results not only that you can also place it in your own space <laughs> say you're at a restaurant you can simply point your camera lens automatically highlights the popular dishes at this restaurant right on the menu when you're done eating it can calculate the tip and even split the total you're flipping through a bon appetit magazine and you see a recipe you like you can point your camera at the recipe and see the page come alive for someone who does not understand the language hear the text read out aloud to you you can also translate it into your own language and hear the words read out loud this time in your own language información para los titulares de la tarjeta already works in more than a dozen languages now we are moving beyond voice and extending duplex to tasks on the web say you get a calendar reminder about an upcoming trip you can just ask google book a national car rental for my next trip the assistant opens the national website and automatically starts filling out your information on your behalf i'm excited to share we have reached a significant milestone further advances in deep learning have allowed us to combine and shrink the 100 gigabyte models down to half a gigabyte small enough to bring it onto mobile devices if we could bring the ai that powers the assistant right onto your phone what if the assistant was so fast at processing your voice hey google open calendar open calculator open photos set a timer for 10 minutes this next generation assistant is coming to the new pixel phones later this year now i'd like to show you the future of how we're improving your mobile driving experience even more just put your phone in the car and say hey google let's drive driving mode has a thoughtfully designed dashboard that brings your most relevant activities front and center while you're driving. There's no need to download an app. Just start driving. Driving mode will be available this summer on any Android phone with the assistant. Another way we build for everyone is by ensuring that our products are safe and private. And with auto delete, you can choose how long you want it to be saved. Incognito mode has a pop has been a popular feature in Chrome since it launched, and we are bringing this to Maps. Now you can confirm a sign in with just a tap. Federated learning it allows Google's AI products to work better for you. Each phone computes an update to the global model and aggregated in large batches to improve the global model. And then the updated global model is sent back to everyone's device. Federated learning however allows Gboard to learn new words like BTS We are announcing a new feature called live caption. With one click, you can turn on captions for a web video, podcast, or even on a moment you capture at home. With Smart Compose and Smart Reply, who is deaf and prefers not to speak, she can answer the call and interact. Hi Nicole, it's Jamie. How are you? Hey Jamie. I'm good, and you? Foldables are great for multitasking. But the feature I'm most excited about is screen continuity. So I start playing a game on the folded smaller screen. When I sit down and unfold, the game seamlessly transfers to the larger screen. It is so cool. Live caption in Q takes audio and instantly turns it into text. Hey cutie, do you want to give your puppy a hug? Is that it? it's entirely done on device. In fact, it doesn't need to be connected to the internet at all. With Smart Reply, the OS helpfully suggests what you'll type next. What's really cool is this works now for all messaging apps in Android. Now, there's one more addition to Android Q that's small, but you've been asking us about for a while, and that is Dark Theme, and we're launching it in Q. <laughs> now, your Android device gets regular up security updates already, so now these can be updated individually as soon as they are available and without a reboot of the device. 
we've created a new mode for Android. It's called Focus Mode. Those apps that distract me are disabled until I come out of focus mode, and then everything is back. In Q, Family Link parental controls will be built right into the settings of the device. Today, I'm excited to announce that Q Beta 3 is available on 21 devices. Google Home Hub, which we're renaming Nest Hub, introducing Nest Hub Max. It's a new product that has a camera and a larger 10-inch display. You can switch on lights, control your music, and adjust your thermostat. The camera has a wide angle lens and it automatically adjusts to keep you centered in the frame. Hub Max is designed to give you full control over the camera. You have multiple controls to disable camera features and a physical switch on the back electrically disconnects the camera and the microphones. Hub Max is designed to be used by multiple people in your home. So the assistant can recognize your voice and respond directly to you. But today we're also extending the options to personalize using the camera. Whenever you walk in front of the camera, Hub Max recognizes you and shows just your information. You're also getting full stereo sound with a powerful rear-facing woofer. With the camera, it's as simple as a gesture. You just raise your hand. <laughs> Nest Hub Max later this summer for just $229. All right, next I want to talk about Pixel. I want to introduce you to the newest members of the Pixel family, Google Pixel 3a and 3a XL. They start at just $399. Pixel 3a comes in three colors, just black, clearly white, and a new color, purple-ish. <laughs> what other smartphone cameras try to do with expensive hardware? We can deliver with software and AI. Pixel 3a can take amazing photos in low light with night sight. We've also enabled Pixel's portrait mode on both the front and rear cameras. And our Super Res Zoom applies computational photography, so you can get closer to your subject while still maintaining a high degree of resolution. Starting today on Pixel phones, you're going to see arrows in the real world to tell you where to turn next. We're just beginning our journey with AR and maps. Pixel 3a uses machine learning to optimize based on how you use your phone. So you can get up to 30 hours on a single charge. You'll get up to seven hours of battery life with just 15 minutes of charging. Pixel 3a and 3a XL are available in 13 markets starting today. <laughs>